Yeah. Ang Angjing? Yeah. Dog? Yeah. Dog. Uh, we want to come later try. We want to oh, yeah. later for dinner? Don't cook for us yet. We want to come later with our friends and see. I'm on my way from misery to happiness to be. We don't kill chickens. Chicken's our friend. No, no, no. Okay, so enjoying Bali, yeah? Absolutely. Love it. Love, Love it, it. Yeah. Love it, Bali. Okay, so what we're talking about today is a bit of a scandal. It was causing a bit of a buzz um, a few months ago, but the yeah. Bali dog meat scandal. Did you hear about it? Oh, Kate probably did. She's a big <laughs> Bali fan. Oh, I really? did. I did. They've been serving people other animals, but it's actually been dog meat. Since when's this happening? Where is this happening? In Bali. Really? Just didn't okay. hear about it. No. So what was happening is like some pet dogs were going missing and some stray dogs were going missing and, and they're being poisoned with so cyanide and then they were serving them up as other animals in restaurants. Mm, oh no, I did hear about that. Yeah. Yeah, oh, yeah. yeah. So you wouldn't know whether you what your animal you're eating Ooh. because dog meat is uh, cheaper. It's cheaper, yeah. Yeah, right. Right. Because yeah. the dog meat's actually cheaper. I so, can imagine is because there's a lot of stray dogs in Bali. Yeah, so they poison them with cyanide and then they're serving them, serving them up to people as so different So we're basically animals. eating cyanide, that, which is a it, killer as well, drug. As well. But we're more focusing on the part that it's a dog. Is, would that make you feel uncomfortable if you found out that it was a dog? Very uncomfortable. Yeah. Uh, do you, you're a dog lover, yeah? Yes, I love dogs. Yeah. Ah, uh, that's yeah. curry. This hey, is curry. Yeah. Uh, curry? Yeah. Soup, like soup. Like soup. Soup. Uh, okay, yeah. okay, okay, okay. So, okay. Yeah. With the rice? We have with rice later. So, how would you feel if you were served up, say, beef and it turned out to be dog? Mortified. 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 Yeah. Mortified. Why? Do you, why was that? Well, A, for the poor dogs, you don't yeah. want to be eating them. Yeah. And I don't B, know, you just, just don't want to be eating well. dogs. A dog. I'd like yeah, to know exactly. what I'm eating. Yeah, you'd like to know what you're eating. Do you think there's a difference between a dog and a pig? Uh, I actually do think there is a difference. Yeah. That makes there's one have. Not, there's not many people have pet pigs. Yeah, yeah, true. And pigs are more farmed. Farmed. And then no one farms a dog. Yeah, true. That's my theory. So that's why one's okay to kill and one isn't. Oh yeah. yeah so exactly. so you you think um, that the the dog's life matters more than the cow's life? Do you think? Um. Oh, is this like a this vegan? This is where we're going. Oh, shit, here we go. I'm not a vegetarian. I'm not a vegan. No. I know a lot of people in this. Part are, but yeah. we've just got it in our heads that dogs are pets. You dogs know, it's what we've been brought up. Yeah. So, for, no so, way. so like, because dogs are our pets, they um, they shouldn't be eaten. But um, say, if a cow was someone's pet, that that particular cow shouldn't be eaten. I don't. I've never heard of cows being pets. We're, we're trying know? to find out like if there's a moral difference between a dog and a pig because people get all, all riled up about dogs. We're trying to find out the psychology behind it. Whether yeah. you think one's one life matters more. Well, one does a little bit because it's your pet, your animal, your family. Yeah. What if it's not your but pet? Still? It's, just a, it's just a... Yeah, but then, see, that's still different. It's someone else's pet. Yeah. But true. the pigs are a different, totally different box of frogs. Box of frogs. Yeah. <laughs> awesome, awesome. You know? Same Always known that, you know, your cows are for milking, pets, dogs are for your pets. Dogs are for yeah. padding, cows no. are for eating. Yeah. Cows are for milking, I said. So, uh, cows are for milking. Mm. What do you think about culling kangaroos? What do I think about culling kangaroos? Yeah. I personally, I don't agree with it, eh? I think that I guess Australian, you're Australian, I'm yeah, guessing. Yeah, where are you from? That's Australian emblem. Yeah, where and are you Australians from? And Australians cull yeah. kangaroos. Yeah, I think that's a bit weird, man, myself. I don't agree with it, eh? Do you? Oh, I, I half agree, because they're pests. Yeah. Like, maybe back in the day, they were our emblem and they weren't pests, but now they're pests wow. to some of the society. Like, same as stray cats. They yeah. turn into wild cats, and then they're a wild cats destroying our native wow. land in Australia, destroying yeah. our native little indigenous species. So if the, if the dogs here were pests, it would be okay to round them up and... Oh, it's the same as crocodiles yeah. in Darwin. Yeah. They cull crocodiles in Darwin. Yeah. And you think that's okay, yeah, as long as... Well, there's every animal who, like... It, yeah. Probably humans are probably overgone and fucked. <laughs> we're pests, eh? We're pests ourselves in yeah. killing what you're saying. We're, we're also pests ourselves yeah. because we're killing these animals you're thinking we should let them survive. But yeah. So we're also a pest. We are. We are. But it's it wouldn't, it wouldn't justify killing a bunch of humans because we're pests, would it? Like, we'd find oh, another well, way. Who knows? Like, it's, it's exactly what humans are doing. We're yeah. killing these pests. Yeah. So if someone was a predator to us, they'd be killing us. But we're the hierarchy and the smartest to not kill them. Yeah. My whole life I was brought up to believe that dogs are friends, uh, pigs to be eaten, cows are for milking. Mm -hmm. And then I sort, of, uh, I sort of had this awakening and I thought, wait a second, from the pig's eyes, do you think that they want to be eaten just like the dog doesn't? Absolutely. Probably not, no. They don't. No, they don't. I don't think so. Have you ever thought about that? Like, 
Yeah, yeah. definitely thought about definitely it. Definitely thought yeah, about 100%. it. 100. Yeah. percent We've got more um, empathy. You think we've got empathy as human we've beings? We've got more feelings and we've got more smarts. Yeah. Do you think if we used our empathy more, we could dictate um, through these matters easier or more more compassionately? Yeah, yeah. yeah you probably could. Yeah. Like if we cared for a pig or a, uh, if we cared about yeah. pigs, it's like we do dogs. Maybe we wouldn't put them in these slaughterhouses and stuff. Maybe. Yeah, it depends how it's brought up. Though, like if you're bringing a pig up to be that's our food. Uh, like we've got to survive away yeah. as well. They bring dogs up to be food too, but you wouldn't yeah. think that that's okay, though. No. Yes, I don't think that's okay. The general idea we're getting from people, except for one person, mm -hmm. um, is that they would be upset if they found out that it was a dog because they have emotional mm -hmm. attachment to it. But mm -hmm. uh, other animals, because we've been brought up, mm, I think that's what it is. You've just been brought up knowing that, yeah, you're feeling like dogs are your pets. Yeah, yeah. Do you think that's? A w like a weird part of our psychology? Mm -hmm. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. yeah, for sure. So, do you think that's a weird part of our psychology that we haven't addressed yet? See, but that's just because how we've been brought up. Yeah. It's that's all the the way people have been brought up with generations over generations is totally. way... Like, there's still cannibals out there in the world. There is. And they've probably been brought up like that, eh? Definitely. But that doesn't make it okay to It doesn't cannibal. make it okay, but that's yeah. what I'm saying. It's okay to their mind. Yeah. It's like, it's okay to my mind, I want to eat pigs. It's, if in the pig's mind, you don't want to eat... In the pig's mind, like... What do you think? In the pig's mind. Like if you look at it from the pig's perspective, that's what we're trying yeah, to... Yeah, we'll see. I've been brought up in my generation, my yeah. way of thinking. Yeah. I think it's okay to eat a pig. Yeah. Wow. Pigs are farmed. Pigs but are not a dog, but not a dog. No, but not a dog, because I've obviously been brought up. I have a pet dog. Yeah. So I'm not going to eat my pet dog. I'm so going to eat I. someone else's pet dog. I'm not going to eat a dog. <laughs> Fry. Is it just soup? It's curry. Soup. Curry. You got it. Ah, oil. Oh. Mm. Yeah. Looks tasty. You, you would agree that maybe all animals across the board are like mm. dogs in the way they don't want to be killed and yeah, for sure. But it's just the way that like everyone's it's, been brought up yeah. that like yeah. you know dogs are your pets. You treat them this way and you don't yeah. eat them. Agree? <laughs> mm. Absolutely. That's your perspective. But on I it. know there's vegetarians, there's vegans, and they have their own different perspective. Yeah. Everyone's got their own opinion. Yeah. And everyone can think their I'll own. I'll leave thing. you with this. If it's not, let's just say it's not necessary to do it for our health or for any other reason. Yeah. And, and if you look at it from the animal's perspective, whatever animal it is, mm. um, would that change the way we'll you think about we'll, it? Well, look, so I was coming from Koh Phangan in Thailand, yeah. catching a ferry to the main Thailand. I seen about 13 pigs crammed into a little thing each. That yeah. is wrong. I think that's wrong. Why though? Well, because that's think they cruel matter? to the animal. Yeah. Like this is cr this animal's still alive and that's been cruel. Yeah. Where are you from? Australia, Western Australia. Oh, you don't think they we treat animals cruel in uh, Australia? Well, oh, they oh. might do. I've never seen yeah. it with my own eyes. Would you ever think about like not eating animals, or it's just too far out of it? We pretty much only eat the occasional. Yeah, we don't eat much meat at all. Wow. Yeah. Wow, that's cool. So it would be pretty easy just to say, hey. Yeah. Well, what? The only we eat chicken for convenience. <laughs> so. Wow. They don't hide it here as much. It's out in the open more, yeah. Yes. So in in Australia, you know. they hide it from us, sort of thing. Well, I don't know. I'm not in the industry. I don't know. Yeah. I never see it. Okay. Okay. But you think that those pigs in those cages, they deserve moral treatment, yeah? I do. Yeah. So maybe, do you think like they deserve to be treated as food then? Even if you, if you, if they don't deserve to be in a cage, maybe they deserve to, more moral well, treatment. They're still, than, they're getting, they're not happy and getting, they're getting tortured, crammed into a little yeah. cage. A bolt gun in the head and a knife across the throat, though, if they were treated nicely. Oh, but they're getting killed. They're done. Like, yeah, they're done. I don't know. Hey, he's doing, it, but it's it's an animal. That's how we've survived over yeah. thousands of years. True. If you want to change it, you can change it. That's every person's opinion. It's their like it's their choice, sort of thing. Like yeah. whether they contribute to it or not. Yeah. Like it's your choice. It's my choice. Yeah. What what would your choice be to contribute to it, even if you don't well, have my to? My choice. I'm not going to lie to you. So I eat meat. I yeah. eat everything. So, yeah. so I'm contributing to all these bad things that are happening. Yeah. But that's my choice. Would you ever change that, or I'd probably never change that. Wow. Well, you you certain of that? Yeah. Wow. All right. I, I I wasn't certain of that. I used to eat meat all the time, and then, and then yeah. I had this bit of a, a weird it was awakening, and I was like, well, I don't have to. Why am I doing it to him for? And I sort of like I changed because I had an awakening. But you're certain that would never happen with you? I'm pretty certain it would never happen to me. All right. Because here in Bali, there's heaps of vegan mm. places where yeah, yeah, we've noticed. Yeah, like Ubud as well. There's heaps mm. of vegan places. Yeah, it's great. And like it's knowing so that. Yeah, knowing that you might be eating like dog that was poisoned with cyanide, the cyanide's mm. still in the mm. meat. Mm. Maybe you could like think mm. more more vegan sort of mm. options. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we do anyway. Yeah, hey. You do yeah. anyway. Wow. We had tofu rice paper like. rolls for lunch. <laughs> Boom. Right. As sad as it is, as bad as the world is. Yeah. But there's fucking worse humans out there than us. There is. There is. Probably doing worse things to humans and then worse things to.
And every animal in the whole world. True. Every human, every animal, every everything. Yeah. But I'm not here to say anyone's a bad person. It's hey, more like, I. yeah, yeah. I'm not one to judge. And like, but like, we can always better ourselves, can't we? We can always better ourselves, but where do you draw the line? How maybe much better can you make yourself? Maybe stabbing animals to death for sandwiches could be somewhere to draw the line. So you're not necessarily stabbing an animal to death like you're murdering like... No, 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 but second hand it sort of is, isn't it? Sort of. It, well it is, like without you're still money. doing the most quickest humane way possible. Yeah, but we don't even see it, so how do we know how humane it is? Yeah, but you know humans are the most f***ed up things on the world. Cool. And on the back we do it like a little challenge, 22 day challenge. Mm-hmm. Aren't we? Yeah, if you look at our actions... Are we or are we not? We are. We can be the most we compassionate kill humans, well. We kill animals, we kill everything. Yeah. Everything in our past will kill. Yeah. But so we can also be... Worst? We can also be compassionate as well. We can also be. I know yeah. this. Yeah. So that's what we're trying to reach out to people and see if they have that capacity, which I think we all do. Yeah, well I do, but I'm still going to stick to my certain... I'm not going to stop eating meat just because... Yeah. Just because of the animal. Yeah. Just because how somebody else will treat their animal. Oh, okay. Little pack of barley dogs. And over here, the beautiful cows. These cows will all be eaten. They'll all be killed. We'll give it a, I'll give we'll it give a whirl. Not, not when I'm half right pissed. Right. No, not right now, but <laughs> so keep it as an idea. idea. When I get back to the and see what we rustle up in the morning. Awesome. Yeah. Thanks heaps oh. for your time, girls. Yeah, I appreciate really that a lot. So gentle and vulnerable, innocent. What's the difference between a dog and a cow? Okay, this is what I'm trying to get through to people. Thanks for your perspective, man. You had an interesting perspective on it, and I'll leave yeah. you this card. You can look at it. You don't have to look at it, but there's some I'm information on there. And on the back, if you feel like doing a little challenge where you don't eat meat, you can go for that. But if not, it was a good yep. conversation, brother. Awesome. Thank Thanks you. heaps, man. Hey, Thanks heaps. I appreciate that. No worries. Thank you. See you later. I'll come back later.